Hello guys, welcome back to the Media Nights. My name is Ari. And I'm Denise. And today we're going to be watching the movie Fury. This is a film that a lot of you guys recommended in our Hacksaw Ridge reaction, our Saving Private Ryan reaction, our Full Metal Jacket, Jacket reaction. A lot of you guys were like, hey, in all of those films, mm -hmm. if you enjoyed this one, you're really going to enjoy Fury. It's a bit more of a, of a modern war film. I know it's about a tank crew and from what I've seen and everybody talking so positively about it, I'm, I'm genuinely excited to watch this. Yeah, this is one of those movies that you guys recommended a bunch and thus far you definitely have not led us astray the david ayer is behind this yeah we we've seen some of his stuff we were looking it up a little bit earlier and it looks like he did a lot of research to make this look sound and feel as authentic as possible you know we got our standards pretty high after that intro on <laughs> saving private ryan i love when filmmakers put in that kind of effort i'm i'm really curious to see how this is gonna do its own take on war because like like i said there's some amazing gems out we've there we've seen some incredible so, films yeah so like the the standards are just rising and rising for that so so like I'm, I'm really excited to see what he's going to do with this. If you guys want to catch the full length reaction, that's going to be available on Patreon. Thank you guys so much to everybody that signed up. You guys are awesome. And it's great reading your comments there and hearing your thoughts on these films. <laughs> and if you want to watch our reactions early, that's going to be available on our YouTube members. So hit the join button to watch that a bit early. Huge shout out to our producer. Nice. Thank you so much, Jack Brucker. And our next D. Thank you guys so much for the support and for being awesome. Thank you guys so much for all of your support. And we hope that you enjoy. We'll catch you guys after the movie. I like the ominous intro. I like it working in the comms. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Germans had that tech with the tanks. It's over! It's over! Hoo -hoo. <laughs> Fury. Oof, that's chilling. What a great shot. I was just thinking that, just seeing the silhouette slowly approach us. Oof, what remains from that battlefield? Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. He got him. Such an interesting juxtaposition, right? You see the cruelty of man, but then you see the kindness he shows towards the horse. Yeah. Even amongst all the rubble. It's almost weird seeing such a beautiful creature, right? Yeah. A amongst all of this destruction. And he's so white and clean. Yeah. Interesting imagery. The score is beautiful. Wow. Hey. hey, Pena. <laughs> He's a great actor, too. Oh, I love him. He's great. Did you get that fucker? I knocked him off. Yeah, you could say that. Yeah, he sure did. <laughs> it's kind of claustrophobic, isn't it? There's not a lot of space in there. Are you still talking? Let's get out of here, boy. Ah, fuck! The fuck you do that for? I'm trying to fix it. You know why. You want fucking whoop me? Yeah, go fucking help anything! Fox. Yeah, the tension is already there. You're in a tight space. You're really screwed in the situation that you're in. God, I'm telling you right now, don't fucking call me that. I ain't a fucking animal. I ain't a fucking dog. Vámonos, cabrón, vámonos. Hey, you want to talk Mexican? Talk Mexican. Did you explain to him it's a tool of war? Hey, here's my tool of war. <laughs> <laughs> yes. You should stop ragging on everyone. You can kill red germs, did. That is true, but I didn't save him either. His number came up, that's all. We've been lucky till now. Mm -hmm. Got it, so he's the one that still carries the sense of hope. Yeah, he's optimistic, at least. Well, you need one person, at least, <laughs> in your group to do that. It can get really dark without hope. Rain's coming. Oh. oh my god. And they can't even move. No. Oh. Can ask any time, sweetheart. Okay. Gordo. Choke her up. She's cold. There's condensation on the pump. Come on, oh, come on. My oh, my goodness. God. They're sitting ducks right now. I can't 
can't even imagine, dude, the, the terror that they must feel. Oh, no. don't do that to what? us. We need to know. Oh my God. <laughs> don't do this to me. Well, the sound design was amazing there. Just hearing those, uh, the, the, the roar of the engine. Mm, just the whistling tune of the impact. Oh, man. Damn, look at them. They're wrecked. R rough shape. Armored warfare was brutal, man. Especially when your tech is so inferior to the enemy, to the Germans in this case. Yeah, their tanks were fantastic, I have to say. Can we talk about how good this tank looks, though? This looks like a real tank. It has to be. It could be, actually, if, if you think about it. I'm pretty sure it's an M4 Sherman. It's what the Americans were using. M4 Sherman. Battlefield taught me this. <laughs> <laughs> Thought you were dead. Devil watches over his own. <laughs> Devil watches over his own. That's a great line. Blame now. Move. <laughs> Sergeant. You can see in his eyes he feels guilty mm. as hell. Yeah. It's the grief. Red's got us all a little sad right now. We got a job to do. We can't do shit about mechanical issues. Where are you going? They're just tired, man. Yeah. All that pressure. I can't imagine what that what that's like, man. Operating at such a high level constantly. Then whenever you get a second to yeah. just breathe. And he's stepping away from them because he feels like he needs to stay strong. He needs to stay stoic so he doesn't freak them out in return. But man. I was told to report to you. I'm your new assistant driver. No, you are not. <laughs> yes. Yes, I am. God damn it. Why he's so young? <laughs> Master Sergeant with the clipboard. Bullshit. Right there. He's What's your name? Norman. Oh, he's just a kid. Yeah. How long you been in the army? Eight weeks. Oh. He's a rookie. Hi, I'm Norman. Which way is the front? Which way is the front? <laughs> hmm. Oh, God. Hey, you go to tank school? Tank school? No. Never even seen the inside of a tank. I'm a clerk typist. Uh, they're gonna be wondering why the hell they sent this kid here. Are you from Chicago? Nah, you from Arkansas, ain't you? No, I'm from Hey, Pittsburgh. hush up, man. Nobody gives a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Wait until you see. See what? What a man can do to another man. Jesus. Bye, Jesus. Why don't you come take a look at your seat? Yeah. That's where you're going. He's a fish out of water right now. Yeah. The odd man out. That's rough, man. You're coming into a crew that's... Tight. Yeah, they're already tight and they've already gone through hell. Like, they just got back, so they got their own shit to deal with. And now <laughs> they got this youngling here. It's a new piece of a puzzle to replace the old one. They're probably feeling some type of way right now. That's nerve wracking, man. You want to do your best job and you don't even know where to start. And there's no room for mistakes here. And he's been in the army for eight weeks. That's, <laughs> that can't be enough time. One hell of a way to introduce him to the reality of things, isn't it? Cleaning off the blood. Yeah. Oh. Oh, God. Fuck. Piece of a face. Yeah. Oh, What's man. What's left of it? Snarly. Jesus. You send five tanks out. One comes back. It's hard to believe we went in the war. Oh, he's going to hurl. He's going to hurl. Yeah. I like how we're seeing it from his perspective, right? The horrors, the, you know, you hear about mm. these things and then when you see them, it's, it's different. Them lugging in the bodies that way. How many of them? Why isn't he sleeping? G2 wants a prisoner to question. Oh, I'll question him. Boss is standing leaving. <laughs> Get back! Get back! Get back! Get back! Oh, it's me. It's me. You got MPs everywhere. You got to stop now. Yeah, it's personal right now. Yeah. You just lost one of their own. He's an SS. You kill every last one you can. The real assholes. Done much killing? You will. Oh my god. <laughs> See that cover? Yeah. Open it. Now you kill it. Close it up. Now you ain't. <laughs> <laughs> that simple, man. That simple. First platoon, mount up, move out. War's not going anywhere, sir. You heard him. Mount up. Time to go right back in. Imagine. 
imagine this kid <laughs> like it's so interesting that we see both perspectives, right? For them, they're the, just going right back in. For him, it's the first time. The veterans and the rookie. Yeah. Hey! Don't fuck yourself, war daddy! Cough is too high. <laughs> You can even see the interactions, some of the banter, you know, they're still trying to keep some normalcy. Yeah. That's a common theme that we've seen with all these movies. Like they still attempt to have normal relationship within the people they interact with. And the gallows humor, right? You got to have some of that dark humor to cope with the craziness that you're facing every day. Absolutely. I'm loving the feel of this so far. The Me grittiness. Too. All right, there might be a wolf hiding in the sheep. Kid, you're up. Cast an eyeball on him. Every five rounds of the tracer so you can see what you're hitting. Oh. And remember, short burst. Jeez. And it's crazy that they have to be wary even of these people. You can feel the tension rising as they're approaching. Yeah. <laughs> they know what they're getting themselves into. She'll let you fuck her for a chocolate bar. Oh my god. No. Okay, it's not true. <laughs> it's completely fucking true. Oh my god. Oh, she ain't gotta fuck around and give her a whole pack neither. Ignore fucking four will do Ignore it. Ignore them. <laughs> Don't disappoint Christ now. Don't let them lead you straight. <laughs> <laughs> Don't try and convert your heathens. You mind if I continue? Heathens. <laughs> Boy, do you think Jesus loves Hitler? Do I think Jesus loves Hitler? <laughs> hey, what about me, huh? You think you can save me? <laughs> Sing me a hymn. Yeah, sure. I like when your mouth moves Don't. when you sing. I like <laughs> I, love, I love how they're teasing each other. At least they got some kind of sense of humor in this. Boy, do you think Hitler would fuck one of us for a chocolate bar? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the cinematography is great so it's far. It's beautiful. It puts you in the place. So immersive. Oh boy. Oh no, is that something we need to worry about? Oh, that definitely is something we need to worry about. Oh. Hey Bush, right. oh, shit, shit, shit. Yeah, they have no visibility on the enemy. Oh my god. That is terrifying. Oh my God. First thing you see is that. They're kids, man. Mentioned in the beginning, right? Why didn't you take the shot? He was, he was just a kid, I'm sorry. You see what a kid could do? Look! That's your fault. Next German, you see with a weapon, you wreck the dog shit out of him. Yeah, it's terrible, man, but there's no room for humanity. No. In war. Can't even allow yourself to hesitate, man. I've said it before, but the sound design is impressive. You can tell they actually went out of their way to record the real thing. It sounds amazing. It's everything. It's the explosions, the rumbles, the planes flying overhead. It really fills up that world. All right, how many texts we got? Four. Four. You shouldn't be. Nope, that's all there is. Mm. It's high ground. You got any eyes on it? I had eyes there. Gone there. Gone. Jeez. Blind, blind. You and me. They have no idea what's on the other side. No. I know you are. I know you know what you're doing. Wow. Oh. They murdered some good boys out there today. At least he's got a good reputation, right, of getting the job done. Mm. Why are we rescuing kittens instead of just driving down to Berlin? Why are you such an asshole? That's a great question. <laughs> <laughs> Keep your spacing, don't bunch up. On my signal, we'll drop the doors and roll up that 75. Mm. Everyone copy. Love one five, copy. Preparing mentally to do what has to be done, yeah. regardless of what that is. It's a trial by fire for him. Yeah, he's deviating from the path, mm -hmm. as he mentioned. Damn it, the other guys are just going in on foot. Yeah, they're using the tanks as cover. Yeah, it's that high ground they mentioned. On. Oh, they can see them coming. Oh, sh All right, here we go. Oh, oh, perfect, perfect, perfect. Good. Straight on, straight on. <sighs> the 
This is gonna be so God. bad. My palms are sweating. Mine too. <laughs> slow, slow, slow. We got bodies. Guys on the floor. Forward, forward. Straight out. Copy. Yep, right wow. behind the tank. Wow. Saved them like that. Level one, three, right stick, right stick. You got troops on the ground. Fuck, right stick, right stick. Oh. Imagine laying down, not knowing if you're about to get ran over by a freaking tank. Friendly tank at that. Damn, dude. Don't freeze again. Come on. Time to shoot, man. Shoot back. Time to shoot. On. Fire. On the one. Wow. Wolf. She's fired. Target destroyed. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit! Oh shit! Anti tank, yeah, yeah. They better not get oh, hit by those. No, that's gonna be bad. Ah. Just a ricochet. We're okay. Bullshit! That's a crowd high velocity gun. I can hear it whistling. You want to take that shit out? Come on! Fire! What? <laughs> yeah, they can't see where he's at. Oh, I think they got him. Cease fire! Cease fire! Target destroyed. Oh. One of them. Oh no! There's another gun. Who's got eyes on it? Yeah, they can't see where exactly it is. Oh. It's camouflaged so freaking well among the trees. Oh, what? Oh, hit him, hit him, hit him. Oh. Wow. Oof. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. Got him. You can just feel the destructive power of these things, man. Yeah. Oh, Get shit. Reload. Did they teach him how to reload, or...? I... hopefully learn the basic training? Do your job! Do what you're here for! Oh, no, I was loading the gun! Hey guys, 12 o'clock, we're to run this bastard over! Oh, oh, man! Oh my god! Ah! Hey, squirt those squats on the left! Oh, I see our dead bodies! How do you know they're dead? Are you a doctor? But they're dead, why would I shoot them if they're already- You don't know that they're dead. Shoot it's an ass! Oh, fuck! Get him! Fuck! Can't fucking be here any fucking more! Turn your goddamn intercom off. You got a ball like that. Yeah, the pressure's pressure's getting yeah. to him. I fucking give up. I can't be here anymore. Same pretty, you know. That's what we do. I feel bad for the kid, but there's no room for this here. Mm. I can only imagine how overwhelming. Oh, it must be terrifying. That must be. It's horrible. All of these men have to be so brave. They have to just compartmentalize that part of themselves. Yeah. And just keep the fighter in. It's like the other side, you can't see them as humans anymore. Yeah. Terrific action sequence, I have to say. Yeah. The tension, the way it's shot, the way it sounds, it feels so impactful. I had the best bow gunner in the entire Ninth Army in that seat. Hmm. Wow. I promised my crew a long time ago I'd keep them alive. You're getting in the way of that. I am not trained to machine gun dead bodies. I am trying my very best. It's tough, man. I get both points. Yeah. He needs to keep his crew alive. This guy's got to do what he's got to do. Because that's the thing. Hesitation like that. Freezing like that. That'll get you killed. Yeah, it's life or death out there. You said, stay scared, bitch. Stay boy. Norman, come here. Oh, no. Are they going to make him do something? I think so. This is my wife, this is my children. Yeah. You are no goddamn good to me unless you can kill crowds. Yeah. Yeah, figured. Put a big fat hole in his fucking back. No. Man. Why the hell not? It's not right. Yeah, he's gonna fuck you up. Why are you here? You're here to kill him. You know why he's here? He's here to kill you. Exactly. You here to get me killed? You gonna get me killed? No. He kills you, or you kill him? You or him? Pick. It's so simple, but it's so difficult at the same time. It's the survival instinct. Just kill me, please. I can't do it. Oh man. Oh no no, that's the easy part. Yeah, he's gonna make him do it. Uh, do it, Norman. <laughs> yeah. Do your job. What the hell? Where you at? I understand both sides, man. Yeah. It's a very difficult thing to ask somebody to take care of somebody else, to kill somebody else. 
But in this situation, it's his crew against all of these yeah. soldiers out there. And staying your hand on the wrong person can get you killed. That's the thing. Showing mercy. That's what we saw in Saving Private Ryan, right? Yeah. You, you can't allow it, yourself to feel because then no. mistakes are made. Because the thing is, you don't know the other side. The other other side might not show you that grace. That mercy. No. It's a very, very difficult situation, man. We've been together since before Africa. Oh, wow. wow. Yeah, but ain't no crew stay together like we have, Norm. Mm. There you have That's it. That's because of him. Yeah, he kept them together. He kept them alive. First time we got shot at down in North Africa. Don, he done shit his drawers full. <laughs> 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 it's true. <laughs> you were saying? <laughs> we move out in 15. Norman, I haven't seen you eat anything all day. Make sure you get something to eat. You can see how they still care for each other. They have to. It's funny because they're in such different stages of this. Like he's still in the denial stage where they've already moved on to acceptance oh, yeah, of this all. They've been doing this. Yeah. Jeez. What a sight. That must be mind-blowing, seeing that over your head. And it's crazy because you're so isolated to what you're doing. Like, you're on the ground, but just with this tank. You don't know what everyone else is up to until you get to your next checkpoint. Yeah, and this war was massive, too. Yeah. I didn't want my children to fight. Oh. The SS does that. Let them rip themselves to pieces, huh? Fuck them. Oh, man. Damn. Yeah, even the people in Germany who didn't want to fight, even they got punished. Opa! Losen die Deutschen Soldaten! Oh! Oh, wow! Pieces of shit, dude. On the right! Oof! Wow. It's incredible. <sighs> Got him. The set design is fantastic, too. This feels like Germany. I wonder if it, if it is a set or if it's a, actually on location. Moving up. Watch that doorway. Watch that doorway. Oh, oh no. Damn. We'll slap him around a little bit for you. Button up. Go ahead. Watch it. Watch it. Oh. 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 Yeah, I think that took care of it. Hey. Is that take care of it? <laughs> Got some Willie Pete in that ground floor. <laughs> Come on, guys. Fire when ready. Shit, shit. Ah. Oh. No, no. Ah, they cooking. Go, go. Ah, oh, man. Mercy kill. Oh. Good shooting, kid. Keep stacking them up. You should have let them burn. He's so always I kill the them wrong. or I don't kill them. Like, what? <laughs> I wonder if it was what you said, though. I wonder if he did it because of, out of mercy. I think so. Minkowski, load an 18, get ready to put in that bank if these people want to test us. Yeah. My pleasure. Mm -hmm. the hand of, the of Glad to see that he's prepared for things to go south because they know. Watch your hand. Hey. Your Come on. Yeah. Here they come. Keep an eye out. Oh, right on. That is horrible, man. Come on. Children. You're literal. using kids and, kids and women, man. Yeah. Teenagers, not even. Yeah. Hey, shoot that guy. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, him, the SS sucker with the busted wing. Hey, Angel. I'll be the same asshole. Yeah. Oh, ho, ho. it's a real piece of shit right there. Getting rid of kids in that horrible way just because they don't want to fight. Hanging them like that, man. Open out those honeys. You flashed them real good. Wasn't nothing, right? Sure, Sergeant. In fact, I kind of liked it. <laughs> He's like, yeah, right. Come on, man. <laughs> At least he's trying, right, to tell him what he wants to, what he thinks he wants to hear. They knew we were coming. So they got drunk as lords and they shot themselves a son up. Mm. Wow. That actually happened. Ideals are peaceful. Mm. History is violent. <laughs> what a line. Ideals are peaceful. He's right, though. History never quite lines up with our ideals, does it? <laughs> nope. Come on. Looks like you missed one. Based up in Blutzen. Oh no. They could be anywhere. 
I'd be terrified. How do you even deal with this situation, man? Yeah. They could just be scared civilians. From them, their perspective, is like the enemy is here. Yeah. Is at our home. Put the gun down. Grab a seat. You make me nervous. <laughs> I don't know, man. I have a bad feeling about this. Yeah, I don't know. Emma. He's terrified, too. Yeah. He has no idea what's going on. Hey. Hey, <laughs> you know what that means. I'm stop. <laughs> See the confusion in their eyes. Yeah. They're like, okay, they're not here to kill us. All right. Man. I have a really bad feeling about this. They show us the other side of humanity, right? Because you see the people that were victimized by their own country as well. Oh. Damn. His back. He's been through hell, hasn't he? Must be such a rare moment, too. You can clean up a little bit, shave. My grandma taught me how to do this. You see this right here. That is your heart line. You are going to have one great love in your life. Ooh. <laughs> smooth, man. Smooth. Very smooth. As far as pickup tactics go. <laughs> Looks like he's going to be a foreigner. <laughs> probably from America. Blue eyes. <laughs> <laughs> And that, my friend, is how you fix a war. <laughs> it's how you beat him. Yeah, it's international relations right With there. With love. Wow, look at him. He's right so cleaned on. up now. <laughs> He's just like, how was it? <laughs> you don't have to say a word. <laughs> <laughs> He's so happy. I know. Look at his face. He's like. <laughs> Seems like it was a pleasant experience on both ends. Sit down. Thank you. Thank you. It's nice heiß. Hmm? Heiß? She's like, uh, be careful, it's hot. Thank you. Oh, no. Norman! Norman! Norman. All you gotta do is come on down. She wide open, just jump on in. Yeah, she looks a little bit like a whore. But, <laughs> <laughs> but it's, it's good. But it's good. It's good. What would you do? Why quiver? Don't worry about me. I'm a friend. He fucked you. He fucked me. The hell work. You gotta pass the plate. Oh my god. Don't, Don't ever fucking tell me what to do. You think you get some pussy and I can fucking act like a man? Anyone touches a girl to get their teeth kicked in. Yeah. Thank you. Nice. Appreciate it. Yeah, they do not yeah. like him at all. No. You see, like, they had such a nice moment, and These how it's just all disrupted right now. Well, they're not prepared to be civilized right now, right? They're, no. they're soldiers. That's the girl's egg. Then why the fuck was my egg? You can see how much he commands, yeah. though. Offer the girl her plate. There you go. Oops. Come on, man. He's such a prick, I swear. Hang on there. I'm going to fix this for you real quick. Oh, man. I didn't touch her. Wow. Damn, he's, he yeah. switched it with her. Like, I'll eat yeah. it. We're going to eat like kings and queens over here. <laughs> we weren't invited. I wonder why we weren't invited. Yeah, I wonder why. Yeah, you guys don't seem like you make good guests, man. No. I don't know. And Norman, do you like horses? Don likes horses. Isn't that right, Don? They're testing him, huh? Yeah. No, we're not. I'm done. I'm fucking done eating. What the fuck is their problem? I don't understand. The fact that it was him and the new guy that were up here, yeah. I'm assuming? Pleasant mealtime talk. Thank you. Sitting here playing house a couple bitch crowds ain't gonna change a fucking thing. Shut the fuck up. 
Yeah. This is gonna get messy between them. I'm just drunk, I'm sorry. The old man wants you. You got a mission. <sighs> Shit. Here we go again. <laughs> The thing is, like, I think once he saw that they could have a civilized situation going on here, he didn't want to bring them in for precisely this reason. Yeah, it seems like the others resent him, too, for the loss a little bit, even though they were saying not to blame him. It yeah. seems like the feelings are still there. Mm. A couple of thousand cooks, mechanics, and doctors here. Those crowds hit him, it will be a slaughter. All we got is you. They have to get in between them. Need you to cross roads as fast as you can. They're going to smash into the supply train and the whole division's fucked. They can't make it to that train. Thank you, guys. Open it up. Yes. Yeah, okay. Good job. Oh. Good job. Good job. Right here. Oh. oh. Shit. Oh, no, not the gas tanks. Time to get the hell out of here. Did it blow up where the women lived? Oh no. Made him mount up. No, I'm not! I got him! Hell up! Oh. oh. You think you are, huh? Jesus Christ! Throw up your ass back on a fucking tight. Man! The only thing. Yeah. Man, this movie really centered in the horrors of war. Like the ugly side yeah. of war. It's a constant reminder, right? You're not in a normal no. state. You can't. It's not a way to live. Those brief moments of normalcy or, or beauty that you can find, it's it can be taken away it's this freaking fast, man. And like you said, it's it's hardened them. If you allow yourself to feel everything, it'll crush you. Yeah, he knows. Yeah. He's probably been through the same shit, huh? It will end. Soon. But before it does, a lot more people gotta die. Yeah. He just calls it what it is. Still. He understands. Jesus! Reverse! Hard left! Hard left! Reverse! They got hit hard. That tank is gone. It blew off the entire top, man. The right. fuck was it? Look. Oh, maybe eight. It's a goddamn tank. Where the fuck is it? Oh. oh. Shit. There it is. 800 yards! I see it. It's a goddamn tiger. What the it's fuck a tiger fuck one, huh? Those tanks were... Ruthless. We have to get to the crossroads. We gotta get past them. One more smoke! Find the bastards! Yes. Why? Oof. They can barely see over the hill. There it is. The Tiger won. All right, all tanks, move forward. Uh, it's three versus one, but they're tanks, man. They were so good. Yeah. Oh my God, look at that. Jeez, man. Motor AP, AP. At least they don't have the best aim, right? Come on, guys, aim. Damn, it's not even denting it, man. Again! Fuck, Ray, put it in now. On the Y! It's not even. No. <laughs> it's not even damaging it. Oh! oh God! God damn it! Oh. Yeah, those things were beasts. Oh no. How do you destroy that thing? This is a great way to compare yeah. the kind of gear they were rocking and what we were rocking. We're so outgunned. They're like toys compared to what they were rocking, man, yeah. with those tigers. Fire! Ah. Ah. Holy shit. It's just you guys. <sighs> just one tank left now. Get around and put us on the backside. If we get behind it, we can kill it. Go, yeah. go, go. On, they have on, all the on. armors front loaded. Mm-hmm. Ah! Oh no! 
Did they just lose the engine? I think so. One of them. That looked like oil that was leaking, right? Come on, guys. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, shit. You missed. I'll call the shot. Roger, Roger. Come on, guys. Roger, now. Reverse, reverse. Come on, come on, come on. Bible steady. 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 Line up the shot. Come on, fucking shoot him. Steady. Now. On what? Ooh. Ooh. That made a dent. One more. Come on. Again. On what? Oh. <sighs> All right, that's two. Okay. okay, that sound. That was a good sound. We like that sound. Nazi. Fuck. Oh, he got into the spirit of it. There you go. <laughs> Man. Well, it changes things once to see what they're capable of doing, right? That was amazing, by the way. That, that was, whole sequence. Holy shit. That was so tense. Re and the score throughout was so freaking good. One tank against three, man. Those things were <sighs> beasts. It took him out like nothing, dude. Holy crap. Heavy weaponry right there. Okay, so now... We need to see what their tank is up to, because they took some damage. Yeah. Radio's 86. We're on our own. Again. That is terrible. What's he doing up there? No one else came up snake guys but us. Lord's protection. We got it, don't we, boy? Yes, sir. <laughs> we got yes, it. Sir. <laughs> you could say that again. <laughs> Best job I ever had. Best job I ever had. Best job I ever had. Yeah, that adrenaline and the yeah. release after that kind of combat. The crash afterwards, I can only imagine. We're still open for business. Let's head out to those crossroads and keep it out of crowd's hands like we've been told. They're gonna go alone. Holy shit. By themselves, man. These guys got balls of steel, man. Man, it's a miracle that tank is still running after all that damage. You can say that again. All right, there's a crossroads. Well, it'll take us up on that hill. We can cover the whole valley from there. Oh! What the fuck? What, what the what hell? Now? Oh no. no! That's it. Mine. What? Settle down. It's a mine. We hit a mine. Is all. What the hell are they gonna do now? Broke as fuck. Busted a bogey too. Can you fix it? Yeah, why not? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, fuck it. I've done worse. How the hell do you fix that thing? I. <laughs> now that's gonna take a freaking miracle for him to fix. <laughs> At the very least, a lot of time. Yeah, maybe some of that Lord's protection they were talking about. Maybe sprinkle some of that in there. <laughs> some on the tank, right? <laughs> Man, I'm sorry. I think you're a good man. I think maybe we ain't, but I think you are. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Come on, let's go. The acting in this is incredible, man. John Bernal is phenomenal in this. Yeah, they probably feel that too, right? They feel dirty when they see someone as good as him. Yeah. After the shit they've had to do, it's probably one of the reasons why they have a lot of the anger directed yeah. at him. It's the guilt. That purity, right? It's like what they used to be probably yeah. before all of this. They see themselves in, in him. It's such an interesting reaction. You envy it, but you hate it. Seems so peaceful, doesn't it? Well, the nature in Germany is beautiful. You get a lot of this there. Which is, again, an interesting contrast to the tanks and the war and the rubble. Yeah. Oh, shit. No way, bro. That's German. All ass. All ass. They're coming. I don't know how the hell they're going to fix this tank in time. Oh, oh Holy my goodness. shit. <sighs> yeah. That's, uh, it's a lot. Hey! Hey! Slow down. They're coming right now. How many? I've uh, got two, two, maybe 300 of them. Jeez. Yeah. No. No, man. When they were singing, they sounded like they wanted to fight. What they were saying? Where? I'm telling you. Right over there. They don't look like they were about to surrender. No, they, their uniforms were clean and everything. They had... A damn SS battalion. Great, my gun. Yeah. Yeah, it's just get our shit, all right? What the hell do they do now? Dude, Norman, go get shit. Go get your pack. Let's go. What are you thinking He's about, man? He's not trying to leave, is he? We ain't never run before. I ain't running now. Oh, my God. 
What are you doing? What do you want to do? You want to shed here? I'm gonna hold this you cross want to shed here? Fucking fighting positions when we ain't got a tight. It's gonna hold the ground for them. No, that fight. don't make Top. sense. Stop! What are you doing? Buying them some time. He's not leaving. <sighs> Get out of here. Get to that tree line. Fuck, man. You can see how much they care for him, too. Take care of yourselves. Get to that tree line. <sighs> it's alright. It's alright. It's my home. Wow. No way. I'm staying here with you. Wow. Hell yeah, man. Who would have thought, huh? Mm -hmm. Boys, get on. Grady, come on. We're gonna stay. Uh huh. The whole crew is staying. And things you don't want to be that asshole that's the only one that actually leaves? Boom. Get us one of them dead crowds. They're gonna have to be very smart here. Yeah, it's tactics. Gonna... I don't know what kind of tactics they're gonna pull here, but they're gonna have to think about something. That's crazy, man. They all decided to stay. He let him go too. He told him it's all right. Light him up. Score is fantastic. It's amazing. I wonder who it is. What kind of rounds you got up there, Norm? We got two. All right. You can now see them how they're finally working as a unit now. I was just thinking, Norm is also, he's used to it now. Thank you. Give me that and they're just gonna wait there. A big sitting duck. <laughs> Might as well get a little tight. Won't be around for the hangover. <laughs> I mean, he's not wrong. Hopefully uh, they do, but... You'll probably care a little bit less. <laughs> Ah, ah, that's better than good. <laughs> Come here. Share some. <laughs> it's so admirable how these people kept their compo their composure. Yeah. In his Bible verse, it goes, Then I heard the voice of the Lord saying, Whom shall I send? I said, Here am I. Send me. Wow. Can we talk about Shia LaBeouf's performance in this? It's amazing. What a great actor. I don't like this, man. This feels like goodbye. Mm -hmm. God damn, son. You fighting fucking drinking machine, ain't you? <laughs> <laughs> That's it. That's his war name. That's perfect. <laughs> hey, I christened the machine. 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 Yep. Not a bad name, eh? Not a machine. bad name. Machine. I love it in here. Yes. Best job I've ever had. Best fucking job. <sighs> yeah. Oh, man. This is heartbreaking. Yeah. Bittersweet. They're coming. All right, boys, kick their asses. He's basically saying, like, keep going faster. Here we go, man. I love how the lighting is in such a way where it highlights just the eyes of them. Almost. Oh, whoa, whoa, oh, 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 oh. Yeah, they're coming up. Surprise. Oh. Yep. Ah, oh, shit. Oof. Right there, motherfuckers. Ooh. Fire. On one. Come on. Nice. Oof. On one. <sighs> oh. God. I love how you can see the tracers going by. Yeah. Bible, put it in that okay. building. It's full of fucking crap. Fire! Fire! fire. Ooh. <laughs> all right, all right. That was beautiful. You clear! On the It looks like it's working. Oh, yeah. They're keeping them at bay. Stop. Bible, stay on them. 15 up, 15 up. Fire again! Yeah. It's just too many of them, though. It's so many of them. And they just keep coming. Right. Doe, it's two o'clock. Give him a big kick in the butt. <laughs> <laughs> Loader, give me another point delay. Skip it on the ground. Bounce those fuckers. Skip it on the ground. 
Go, boys, go, boys! Great, 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 come on now. Come on, come on, come on, come on. They're holding their own, man. They really are. I need you can! We out, we out! We gotta catch rupture. He's got his go. No. No. 30 on the roof. Alright, we got ammo outside. Outside? Grab that grease gun. Copy. Hover right. Bible, get ready to snatch that 30. Yeah, they're gonna need that cover. Yeah. Pop that smoke. Come on. That smoke better work, man. Yep, cover. <sighs> that is nerve wracking. Mm -hmm. Having to leave the comfort of your your tank. Oh man. Come on, come on, come on, get back in there. Ah, Ooh. please, please, please. No. no, 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 get back in, get back in. Oh, oh. I mean, yeah, that works too. Oh. Oh. No. I knew it. Hurry up, Brady. Oh. Oh. Come on. Shoot him, Bible. He's getting him. Oh. <laughs> Ow. Look at him reloading like that. Good for you. That but was, it was a close a, call. It was just the shoulder, right, though? Yeah, he only got hit in the shoulder. I mean, just. <laughs> Shit. Oh, yep. They're right there. They're coming, they're coming. That's a fault, four o'clock! Reverse right! Oh. Ah. He missed! Hit him with the coax! Come on, come on! <laughs> Shit. Shit. Oh! Oh, oh no. Oh. Get up! We're still in this fight! We're still in this fight! They don't even have time to mourn. No. Now's not he got the time. Hit bad, man. Yeah. It looked like it shredded through his it, inside. It, it destroyed him. Yeah. How long can we keep this up? Come on, keep shooting! Fuck him out! I'm out! He's out? Oh my god. They're out of ammo. Okay. Please no headshot right now. I just <laughs> Yeah. That's the thing, right? It could happen at any moment now. Yeah. They are so exposed. So exposed, man. They're everywhere. Oh. Okay. Mm. Oh. Nice. Good aim. Come on. Go, go. I need a weapon. Bible, no. Yeah, they can't keep this up forever. Where's Bible going? <laughs> Woof. Nice. He's oh. flanking them. He's trying to grab their weapon. One of, of theirs. Course. Smart. No! Oh. Come on, come on, come on! Oh shit! Throw it out! Oh my god. Oh shit. Wir Schweinehunde! Wir werden euch lebendig heuten! Schweinehunde. Fuck you! Yeah, he's mowing them down. Yeah, fuck him. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Give him some grenades. <gasps> what the hell? Oh, man. I said this was gonna happen. No, please. It's a sniper. <sighs> it's gonna be just machine. The pain, man, they must be feeling right now. The will it would take to get back up and continue to fight. Of course.
course he's getting back up. No! Ah. Oh. Shit, man. That one went through the heart, I think, right? I think so. He just took three shots. What now? I'm sorry, son. <sighs> it's okay. I did my best. I really did, man. I really did. I know. I know. There was too many of them. Oh, fuck. I want to surrender. <sighs> Please don't. They'll hurt you real bad. And they'll kill you real bad. <sighs> There's not a way out of this. No. There's a hatch. You know where it is? I know where it is. I can't imagine how scared he must feel. It's like death is right on your doorstep. What the fuck? It's terrifying, man, on a different level. And <gasps> oh. No. Go. Oh, that's it. I can't imagine being in that position. Dude. Surrounded by the enemy and you're all alone. And he's the new kid. How the hell do you even survive after this? Wow. Man. He yeah. got so lucky, that guy. He got so lucky. Felt mercy. Gave him mercy. That's crazy. He just let him go. He didn't say anything. Where do you go after this? I mean, you're in the enemy's country, man. You're by yourself. How does he even get back to base? Damn, man. He lost his entire tank crew. Yeah. yeah. Finally, get some peace. What's that? What the hell is that? No. Oh, there's someone right outside. Fuck me. Yeah. Oh, shit. <sighs> oh. Oh, no way. Easy, boy. Easy now. One's alive. Thank God. They're here. Wow, excellent performance. You can see how yeah. discombobulated he is from that entire night. You can see he can't quite believe he made it out alive. You hit? You hurt? Um, oh, seem all right. Let me take Wow. By the way, that entire sequence with the tank and the battalion and just mm -hmm. them reminded me a lot of the story of Audie Murphy. Same thing, a tank versus a bunch of people and just holding down the line. I wonder if it's a reference to that. I wonder. Wow. Machine is the one that mm -hmm. ended up getting out of there alive. He held his ground though. He did. He did good. But you also mm -hmm. see the transition of how war changes man. Yeah, how it breaks you. And it's so weird because it you get stronger, but you also get more broken. Man, that fury tank. Jeez. They they fought like all hell, man. They made the most of it. Everything yeah. that they had. They really did. Wow. Look at all those people. They did that. That was just them. In the crossroads. Yeah. They held the crossroads. Wow. Wow. David Ayer. Great job, man. Wow. Writing and directing. Fantastic. That was excellent. That was a really good film. I thought the cinematography was incredible. The atmosphere that they were able to build. There's a lot of work here to maintain the feel of a World War II, you know, must have felt like. And of course, we will never understand what that must have been like. But, you know, I thought the translation onto the screen here was done excellent. It, it was done in such a great way. The sound design did a lot here to carry that, you know, that weight too. You could feel every single bullet that was 
was being shot. Every time you would hear that tank gun fire, you you could feel the power behind it, the bass, the rumble, the the impact. And I felt like that would that did a lot to keep us immersed in the action sequences. And also the way they were shot, the way that the the, the camera movements and all that, it was done in a very smart way to, you know, everything was very clear. Sometimes with these action films, specifically war films, things can get a bit too shaky and it's really hard to discern what exactly is going on. To be fair, the ones that we've watched here on the channel, they've been really good. I mean, Saving Private Ryan, it was intentional, right? To feel that that feeling of being discombobulated and and, and not really understand what's going on because the, the people on screen really don't know what's going on. They're also lost. I, I love the, the Sherman versus Tiger one fight yeah. sequence. That was excellent. Like them trying to get past behind them so they could get a clear shot uh, it's probably one of my favorite sequences in this film absolutely agreed and also i think uh what really assisted the cinematography i think it was also the editing it helped keep things as clear as possible without really sacrificing the the tone that they had maintained throughout the entirety of the film it was gritty enough but like you said it was still clear and i i really really enjoyed like you said uh, the sound design and the score stephen price did an amazing job with this like it knew exactly when to really just bloom and become big and go sentimental but it also knew when to kind of go a bit more quiet just be yeah. in the background and kind of uplift the movie rather than take center stage you know like when you're composing a score it's 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 really you you want to leave your signature but you also don't really want to overshadow the movie it's all supposed to come together as one whole piece the performances were oh my god stunning and every single one of them again the performances are supported by great writing because every single one of these men this crew this fury crew right we got to know each of them in their own way i wish we could have gotten to know them better like i wish we could have seen them more in like a normal casual setting you know what i mean like their banter their jokes it was dark humor it was funny it was fucked up but it was a great way for us to kind of catch a glimpse into who these men are when they're not warriors the writing going in tandem with every single performance in this was fantastic the moment where uh shia labeouf's character when bible looks up at brad pitt's character war daddy just the, yeah just like the look in the eyes and the way the lighting and the composition of the camera it was amazing i'm i'm very very impressed with how well everything worked together in tandem yeah i think uh, they really nailed the balance here to tell a good story everybody pulled their weight here shia labeouf did incredible john mm -hmm. bernal did amazing <laughs> michael Pena. i mean everybody involved <laughs> in this were absolutely great logan lerman he <laughs> he was the heart of a story right him as mm -hmm. machine and seeing that transition of what war can do to to a person right someone that is a good man that is pure but at the end of the day it's about making that sacrifice, right? You have to put your humanity aside in order to survive, specifically in these situations. And man, this I love how this movie made it clear how difficult it is to do that. You know, I think everybody would struggle with that decision. It's, uh, it's a big call to make. You know, you're taking somebody else's life away to them or you. Right. And I think the way that this movie depicted war was a really good balance of, you know, both survival, but also the, the horrors that both sides can commit sometimes just because that's the nature of it. Right. It's not a pretty thing. And even there's a line here where it's like, yeah, it's not pretty. You know, what we do is not not nice. This is this is the gig. I thought the way they, they went about it was uh, respectful, yet honest and uh, grounded to what reality is, which made me appreciate the film that much more. I thought it was interesting that they really showed how the people, the Germans that lived there that were opposed to this, how they were also strung up and hung and also persecuted. A lot of Germans, they, there were the ones out there that didn't want this. And you just see how everyone is just victimized by what's been happening with World War II. Like, no one came out unscathed. Like you said, it did a, it did a really good job of like portraying things as they were rather than kind of Hollywoodify it. I I would say it didn't feel over dramatized. It didn't feel overly cheesy either. Like they lingered in the vulnerable and the emotional moments just enough. You got just enough of the joy and the laughter and the normalcy. And then it just ripped it away from you. And, and it hurt every time that happened. Yeah. It hurt us. And that just shows you how good the writing and the pacing of it is. Like you get your lulls. You get some fantastic action sequences. Like speaking of the ending, that swan song of theirs, Wade 
they just hunkered down in that tank and they just did the most that they could. Man, that was a fantastic sequence. It was amazingly shot. Every single sacrifice that we saw, it, it just, it was just painful. You know, like it felt yeah. like we were losing a comrade like to us. Every you know? single loss was a, uh, yeah, yeah. It had an impact and it felt like a, a true loss because you know, it's not that many in there, you know, and every <laughs> single person is pulling their weight and doing mm -hmm. a lot to keep these people at bay. You know, once we lost the first one, it was like, man, you, you felt that loss. And, you know, then we lost two and three and then, you know, at that point, you're like, yeah, they're they're done. There's no way they're getting out of this. I have to say, if you guys enjoyed this movie and you do not know the story about uh, Audie Murphy, definitely check it out because it's basically this, but <laughs> it, it but it happened in real life. And it's it's an incredible story. Watching this made me want to film talking about his story because I think people would really be interested because that almost incredible to believe that that actually happened. But yeah. I really enjoyed this movie, man. Yeah, I love David this Ayer movie. really impressed me here with his directing, his writing. This was mm -hmm. probably the best movie I've seen thus far from him. Really enjoyed it, guys. Thank you yeah. so much for suggesting this. We hope that you guys enjoyed. And as always, we'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care. See ya.